Good morning, CMS. Today is Wednesday, March 13th. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge, I pledge allegiance, allegiance to, to the flag of the United, the United States, States of America, America and, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, nation under God, God indivisible, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For today's menu, we have a chicken and cheese enchilada, a sausage pizza, grilled chicken sandwich, chef salad, and an uncrustable. And for tomorrow's menu, hot corned beef with Swiss cheese sandwich, Bosco sticks, hamburger sandwich, cheeseburger, Italian wrap, and lastly, an uncrustable. For today's birthdays, we have... Alyssa Bell. Congratulations on having a birthday today, Alyssa. Now we have a special announcement brought to you by Emerald Key. <clears throat> this is your weekly study tip number three, and it's flashcards. It is a very simple and easy way to study. You can study all on your own, and you can study with multiple people. It can be very beneficial for everyone in your study group the one reading the cards and the guessers. I love flashcards. Yeah, I used I to use them when them. I was a kid. Yeah, I think they're pretty helpful. Thank you, Emerald Keith. Yes, awesome. Thank you so much. I used to have flashcard races. Did you ever go around the room and do like flashcards and you would have to like, oh, yeah. yeah, and that was like around the world? Yeah. It was so fun. All right. Cloverleaf, middle school cheerleading. If you are a sixth and seventh grader and you are interested in cheerleading, uh, here is the class code. Just You can take a picture of it. Well, no, you can't because you're not supposed to have your phones. Anyways, just try to remember it and or write it down with a pencil or writing utensil. Yeah. Yes. Um, uh, just know that there is a mandatory meeting for students and parents uh, May 1st, and that's going to be at 6 p.m. in room 209. There is no cheerleading experience necessary. None. Uh, and you're going to be trying out for football and basketball. Yeah. Name that tune, the March 12th song, Hotel California by the Eagles. Hotel California is a classic rock song by the American rock band Eagles. It was released as a single in February 1977, and it also appeared on, the al on their album of the same name which was released in December 1976. The song was written by Don Felder, Don Henley, and Glenn Frey, who also sang lead vocals on the track. The song became one of the Eagles' most iconic and enduring hits, reaching the top of the Billboard's Hot 100 charts, and winning the Grammy Award for Record of the Year in 1978. It remains a staple of classic rock radio and has been covered by numerous artists across different genres. And guess who chose the song? That's right, it was Mr. Tim. And I believe there is a uh, change. It used to be Wingate was number one for so long. Now she has been dethroned and Nakel now takes oh, the lead. Nagel. I know, that's impressive. <laughs> The CMS Penny War leaderboard. Oh, Yetis were actually negative. They were the ones losing the most yesterday, and now they are on the top in first place with 9,032 points. Yes, I mean, they went from zero to hero, actually, but of course it's negative. So, I mean, it's from negative to hero, I yeah. guess I would say that. Hashtag Clover Squad with 5,775 points. Yes, and everyone else is negative, unfortunately. Yeah. And moving on to the next, yes, that's right. Thank you so much. Yes, it's show your cold pride time. Be responsible. Be respectful. And be safe. Have a blessed rest of your day, Cloverleaf.